hello guys welcome back to my channel so this is what we're gonna paint today and without wasting any time just let's get started okay so the first thing here is you need a canvas i'm using a round canvas 30 centimeter diameter canvas and whatever size you want to choose it's up to you so the first thing here is to you know prepare the surface of the canvas so for that i'm using a primer which is gesso and you need to put some you know gesso onto the surface and it just makes the surface much a smoother to paint so it's a very necessary step to do and when it dries out then you can start by making a rough sketch with the pencil or you can use a color uh, colored pencil as well that's up to you so I'm choosing the design of an a royal elephant a, a royal elephant uh, along with uh, some soldiers two soldiers uh, walking down and one king is sitting on top of um, the elephant so if you don't want to draw those you can skip that part and just draw the elephant only that's totally up to you and when you will finish the sketching the rough sketching like this then you can start uh, painting it with acrylic colors i'm choosing some fabricrel uh, acrylics here along with some other brands so not a particular brand that i'm using here that totally depends on you so let's get started with the painting so the first thing i will paint here is the um, the elephant itself and then i will choose the background color so the first here is uh, the color of the elephant i want to make it look like a dark gray blue gray kind of color so i'm mixing some royal blue along with some uh, burnt sienna and a little bit of white as well uh, later when i just make want to make it a little bit lighter than this shade so then i will fill the color in the elephant and then later on i'll move on to uh, painting the soldiers and the background so let's paint the elephant first
once you finish all the paintings of you know this the basic layer of uh, the whole painting uh, along with all the soldiers and uh, the elephant you can move on to give more detailing in onto the surface as i'm making some you know lines and lines and just some creases uh, in elephant skin with the darker shade of uh, color so this is what you're gonna do first we'll just make the basic you know the paint and then move on to detailing so once you finish with the detailing we can do the background Okay, so the background color I just did a poll on the Instagram. Someone suggested, um, for, you know, of the for the peach color. I love the whole idea because I never tried this color in my background, so I liked it. But I thought this just, um, you know, do some kind of texture to the background because first I thought it's looking a little bit um, plain but uh, so that's totally an optional idea if you can do this if you want to make some kind of you know design or a patchy kind of uh, background you can do this and it will look something like this it is a first option for the background but then I thought it's not looking that good I want to make it plain so again what I did is again I made it um, you know just a bold plain um, peach color to the background but as you know I can't do anything plain I need to give some pop to my painting so I couldn't resist myself and I gave um, you know small white flowers from the fabric Kira 3d liner so I think they are looking pretty cool but you can also skip this part as well if you don't like this and that's totally up to you. So this is what today guys this is what I made um, this week for you all and I hope you enjoyed the video and uh, if you are not on my Instagram please go there and follow me there as well. I post some you know regular paintings that sometime I don't make a video about so do follow me there and if you are not following me here on this uh, you know YouTube please please subscribe to my channel and give me a huge thumbs up if you like this video and till then bye bye see you next week I'll come up with a new idea for you all bye bye